New tonight, bidding farewell to an internet sensation from Indiana who advocated for special needs pets like yeah, herself. That's right. The famous cat from Bloomington died unexpectedly this weekend at eight years old. News 8's Julia Dang talked to her owner today. And uh, Julia, the cat has millions of followers. Yeah, Phil, on each platform, her death made international headlines today. And she made a difference in the lives of not only other rescue animals, but thousands of people who had the opportunity to meet her. And like many celebrity stories, the tale of Lil Bud had unlikely beginnings in a tool shed in Unionville. <coughs> the runt of a feral litter. Lil Bud may have been little and hampered by physical challenges, but owner Mike Bradovsky says <coughs> the fighter feline not only thrived, she accomplished enough in one short lifetime to fill nine, shining a light on pets with special needs, raising an estimated $700,000 for charity, and racking up millions of social media followers. It was so easy to rub her in as like a famous cat or an Instagram cat, but she's really a lot more than that. In a phone call with News 8, Rudofsky still talked about her in the present tense. Overcome with grief after her death Sunday morning, he declined all TV interviews. But Bud, as he affectionately called her, was no stranger to the spotlight. With her internet fame, the two highlighted issues, including the benefits of pet adoption, in this video from September. The only way to get a pet is by adopting one. The Bloomington native adopted eight week old Bud in 2011 after she and her siblings were found in a shed. She was discovered by my best friends, girlfriends sister's roommate's boyfriend's mom. A friend texted him a picture of the half pound runt, and it was love at first sight, even though he had never seen a cat quite like her. She's very small. She's polydactyl, which means she has extra toes. Uh, her teeth never grew in. She had a form of feline dwarfism and osteopetrosis, a bone disease vets say no other cat has ever been diagnosed with. She was literally one of a kind and on a platform where many may feel pressured to fit a mold. She made different cool. She's sort of like a beacon of hope to a lot of people that, that can't find uh, the support they need in traditional places. And owner Mike Bradomsky says he is hoping to work with aerospace engineers to launch the cat's remains into outer space. He wants to start a website where fans can track Lil Bud's satellite location. And each revolution around the Earth would mark an occasion to donate to their favorite charities. I will have more information on wishtv.com. Live in the studio, Julia Dang, Wish TV News 8.